This video shows how to score the modified NIH stroke scale horizontal gaze section. The patient is given a target to follow so that we can examine the full range of horizontal gaze. As the patient demonstrated normal horizontal gaze in both directions, this is scored zero. This time, the patient does not follow the target towards the left, but there is normal rightward gaze. These findings represent a partial but not total gaze palsy, and so the item is scored 1. On this occasion, we're testing rightward gaze, and we see that there is a partial gaze palsy in this direction. This also represents a partial gaze palsy, and the item is scored 1. On this occasion, the patient has a forced gaze deviation to the right, and no eye movements are seen. Because there is a forced gaze deviation, the item is scored 2. In the patient with altered mental status, the oculocephalic or doll's eyes maneuver should be performed. In this case, we see the eyes moving in the direction opposite that of head movement. As the eye movements appeared to be unrestricted with the oculocephalic maneuver, this item would be scored 0. Care must be taken in performing the doll's eyes maneuver in intubated patients or patients with cervical spine precautions. To review, here are the correct levels as shown in the doc flow sheet. If there is partial limitation of eye movements, score a 1. If there is complete absence of eye movements or a forced gaze deviation, score a 2.